What is up? Yeah, sorry, I haven't been uploading lately. I was gonna upload a video of a fly I did on the Duchess from Fort Pierce to Tallahassee, but the cameras weren't working that well. Now, last week I went to Miami to uh, the Point Training Center with a school called FIT Flight Training International. I did my ATP course. Gonna post some of the videos. I did. I couldn't record everything because you know sims uh company's policy i couldn't record that much but I, I recorded some stuff i'm gonna post that up right now keep watching the right yeah. runway four out so those are the way you double check everything Okay. Thank you. All right. Now the other thing is uh, okay. So now uh, your uh, trainer one line up and runway zero four left line up and wait. Line up and wait. Training uh, one two three. Okay. And the thing is, th these jet air the jet airplanes they. It takes a while to spool the engine up, so it's not like a little airplane where you put the power and it taxes right away. So you got to be careful not to put too much power on because you're gonna hurt somebody or, or equipment behind you. How we call that inertia? Inertia? No, no, it's just well, it, it needs inertia. Is it just all it is is it just takes a little while for the engine to spool up. It's not instantaneous, it's instantaneous. as you see it. Once you get it up there, it takes about, uh, uh, you know, probably no more than uh, than 40 on the E per, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, in the N1 to get start moving. Okay, so now I got a little bit more wind here. I got wind is uh, 310 at 15. 310 at 15. So 310 is going to be a left crosswind, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, Push and right. You know now these airplanes. Uh, if you if you put, we don't usually you take off like that because uh -huh. it's going to the spoiler is going to more than five degrees and uh, the spoiler is going to all come out and it's going to create a problem. So what you do is you kind of accelerate and when you when you, you keep the wing if the wind wants to if the wing wants to come up you're obviously correct for it, but you just kind of accelerate and then pull it off the ground fairly quickly and then let it weather wane. You know, the airplane, as soon as you pull it up, the airplane is going to go fly like that. All right? Okay, and uh, you are cleared. Oh, hold on, let me just turn these big lights off. Okay, clear for takeoff. Trainer one is clear for takeoff. So clear engage for... LNAV on the ground. Oh, no. Yeah. yeah, there you go. That way you don't have to deal with that, right? Yep. At a thousand feet, it's going to automatically go into climb thrust, uh, and what you have to do is crank this up so to the up, you know, so this airspeed is on the up. Otherwise, you you remember how it always slowed yeah. down? Yeah. Okay. And then call for the cleanup. Okay. All right, okay. Ahead, Turn the one clear for takeoff. Press set. set. Hands on the front end. Until B1, then you take your hands up. Just check that LNAV is engaged. LNAV is engaged? It's engaged. Yeah. You look up, don't look up there, look up there if it's engaged. Yeah, there you go. Okay, there's a thousand feet, right? A thousand feet. Crank it all the way up until up. There you go. And 
you well, there you go and, and uh, you can call for flaps one once Flaps. that uh, once that what you pass that little white mark see that little white yeah. mark there just disappeared as you went to Flaps as one. long as you're above that and then once your uh, that arrow goes through one you can call for up flaps up flaps up flaps up and you say after takeoff flaps up after takeoff after takeoff okay after takeoff means that goes down the, the auto brakes go off three things auto brakes go off and these come off three things okay. Okay. The trainer one contact departure contact departure the one Departure, turning one, two, three. That's in fit to go. Climbing. Roger, trainer one, uh, Roger, uh, maintain 5,000. Maintain 5,000. Turning one. Actually, trainer one, climb, maintain uh, 8,000. Climb, maintain 8,000. Okay, so got to do one of two things flight level change or VNAV, one of the two. Which one do you want? Fly click fly level change. Level change right there. Yeah. There you go. Just, uh, and if anything, you got you you want to be on the center line. That's it. On on glide pad on the center line. Okay. And just hold it like that, and then uh, you're still uh, you know fairly high, so you know I wouldn't grab it. Okay. Now I would start, okay, if you're going to start crabbing, you know, try to straighten it out so the airplane's going straight and not drifting. You know, line it up with the center line, enough bank and enough rudder to keep it, keep it going right there. Just Approaching keep that left, decision height. left tail around, left tail around. Don't let, don't, you're going to drift. If you get that aileron out, you're going to, you're going to drift. A little rudder, Lenalons. little aileron. Just hold it right there. A little aileron, a little rudder. Hold it right there. Beautiful. Hold it right there. Hold it right there. That's it. That's it. Just little corrections. Hold it right there. Start flaring. Start flaring. Hold the arrow around in. Hold the arrow around in. Twenty. Hold the arrow around in. Hold the arrow around in. Hold the arrow around in. Hold the around in. Beautiful. Awesome. Fucking great. Nice. There you go. Hold that arrow around. There you go. See, you can do it. Son of a yep. bitch. That's pretty darn, pretty darn good. I couldn't do it that good. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. You saw how, how you had to, you know, and you got that feel. That's a, that was a beautiful landing. And right on the center line. That's a, that's very, very important. Okay. Before landing checklist complete.
tend to drop a little bit low at uh, you know just and then you come back up okay but you know just try not to drop low you know just hold this right steady glide pad all the way down okay I'll try. I mean your 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 landings are beautiful okay here you go Decision height. Come in hot. Minimums. Running sight. 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. do this time and this one one uh, next time is I'm gonna send you around okay I'm gonna say uh, trainer one go around okay and when you go around you know just you know hit the hit you don't hit this you press don't, here. that that's a go around button okay. and then you, you call for flaps uh, 15 positive rate gear, gear up. up okay, okay. alright okay, on the This, unless you want to do it manually, so you can just cut it off. Decision height. Twenty feet to go. Uh, 
minimum. Straight on, go around, go around. Go around. Get your hand on the throttle, no? Okay. You know, you know. Not 15. Not 15. Okay, for the team rate of command. Gear up. Gear up. Wait. <laughs> 